Today, I want to do my nails. I haven't done my nails. Honestly, I feel like since last year, I haven't done my nails. And it's crazy because I literally have the whole kit to do my nails. I have everything I need to do them, but I just stopped doing them. I think once I came back from Colombia last September, they were just really damaged. And I just wanted my nails to heal. And now they are pretty healed, so... I want to get them done. I, I remember I've been seeing my old videos with me and my nails. And I'm like, they look so freaking good. Like, I just want to have that back. So I'm going to be doing my nails. So recently, I got new shoes for the gym. These are actually really nice for the gym. But I just needed, like, a flat shoe to be able to, like, lift weights and stuff. But look at these Converse. Ah! They are so pretty. I was actually going... Because my old ones... I don't know if you guys remember, but they have like holes and I've been wearing those to the gym. They're so bad, but um, I was actually going to get these like light pink ones and then David saw these and he's like, look at these. And I was like, those are so beautiful. This is the, the this side, super cute. And then this is the other side. Oh, I love it. And then the inside is like green and I just love I just, I just love them so much. So I'm super excited. I wanted to do my nails maybe like an off-white and then do like a tip with like this color. I think would look super cute. But yeah, these are my new shoes. I, I haven't, I worn them out of the store, but ever since then I haven't put them on. I have to go to the gym today uh, for a class. So I'm going to be wearing these to the gym and I'm so excited. But yeah, I'm going to be doing my nails. I wanted to show you guys this bag that I got because... I used to have all my nail stuff in like a in a drawer in my room and like in my vanity and stuff and so when my friend would come over because I used to do my nails with her a lot I would take out the whole drawer and basically put it on my table and do my nails but this I got it so that I could organize everything and it's just so nice so this is the top I have all my nail tips my lamps my drills all of that stuff and in the bottom one I have like my nail polishes Oh my gosh. <sighs> ah. So cute. I'm gonna go ahead and prep my nails. I'm gonna start drilling them because I and cutting them because some of them are longer than others, but also I get a lot of dead skin. If you guys have any tips about dead skin around your nails and stuff, let me know because I get just so much skin. Like I just I wish I had like cleaner nail beds, but let me prep all my nails and drill i actually ended up moving to my living room juniper is right there but i have my drill connected over here and i have a towel right under me so i can catch all the nail dust and then this is the one that i'm using right now just to kind of go around like the edges and buff out like my nail and take the shine off that's what i'm gonna do I just go like that on my nail. After buffing all of the nails out, I tried to kind of go in with um, a nail file and make them even and so they don't have like sharp edges or anything. I tried to take a, make my nail bits as nice as possible. This is what they look like. Ah! Um, some of my nails are stained yellow because I made some... <laughs> some golden paste with turmeric and it literally stained some of my nails but it's okay because it's gonna get covered by beautiful beautiful nails i have all my nail tips here and i just have to go ahead and look at each size and see which ones fit my fingers which is literally always the same so i already kind of know like what fits and what doesn't it's usually like three six seven and see like the more well, the full ones are the ones that I never use and there's some that I use a lot That don't even have that many in them as far as lamps I love this one. It's probably the easiest for me to use when I'm gluing on my nails And this one came I think it came with the kit that I got but I'm gonna plug this one in and I have my little My little station right here by the fireplace basically you just put your finger in there and it, and it works I'm gonna go ahead and put this primer on them. This kind of just makes them just dry. I have a lot of nail shine, so I really try to get all that. Oh, that stinks. Get all that shine out so they can stay on. And every time I do my nails, honestly, they last me for a really 
long time, so that's good. After this, I'm gonna start putting them on on this hand, which is my non. Is this my non? I'm gonna put them on on this hand. No, I'm gonna put them on on this hand, and then <laughs> I'm gonna start with this hand. So what I do is I put a small little dot on here, like that, right there. And then I put some on my nail that I'm gonna glue on, like a little light coat on it. Boom, boom, boom. And then I cure this for like five seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then I'm gonna go ahead and put this nail on this finger very carefully and straight because my issue sometimes is that I don't even put them on straight. And then I'm gonna cure it and try not to get like any bubbles in there. Ah. Once the light turns on, this is what it looks like. I feel like that's crooked. <laughs> it looks, I don't know, it looks fine. Once you cut them and you shape them, everything's okay. So now I'm literally just gonna do that same thing I just did, but with all the other nails. The nails are on, they're super long, so I definitely need to cut them down. Um, I have this little tool right here to cut them and it cuts them all to the same size. It has this little thing right here, you pick like which side you want. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a number four. Um, so basically you stick the nail in and it cuts, it cuts them like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut all of them and then I'm gonna shape them. And I'm thinking I'm gonna do uh, almond shape. That's like my favorite one. I just need to make sure I'm cutting these right. And for the almond shape, for the almond shape, I'm just gonna cut like the sides and then I'm gonna shape them more like further with like the nail file. But this is super easy, you just boop. Stick your nail in there and that thing will stop it and then ba boom. Look at that. Oh. See that's the only thing I don't like. This thing like doesn't stay on. And so now I just dropped all the nails everywhere, but whatever. I can clean that up. See? Ah! Whatever. But they are all cut and they're all the same size. I'm just oh sorry. <laughs> Just gonna cut them all. I'm gonna go ahead and file them. I try to get them as even as possible. I think they look pretty good. Mm, I don't know. And I think I, I like the length. I think they, they're a little bit long, but they're nice. Oh my god, this lighting today has just been awful. But once I get the shape, I like to buff the top of them just so that I get that shine off so I can paint them. Honestly, I feel like I put these on really fast. And I actually forgot a step that was to buff out the inside of the nail before I glued it on so it could stick better. Hopefully these last me a long time, we'll see. But I think I'm going to do yellow and green. Um, but I think I'm going to add white to the yellow and then black to the green to kind of make it like a darker green and this more like a pale yellow. I think that's going to be my my combo have my foundation and my top coat so i'm gonna add my foundation to all my nails i think i'm gonna do one at a time i think i'm gonna do one nail at a time i've been here for like two hours i actually painted one of my nails with the yellow and the green and i just did not like how that looked at all so i went ahead and i painted them excuse me i painted them pink they're a little messy, but this is what they look like. Super cute. But now I need to do my other hand really quickly. It's 5 o'clock and I need to be out of this house by 6. All right, you guys. A million hours later, I'm finally done with my nails. This is what they look like. Do not look at them so close because, you know, I still need to wash my hands. And I have little crusties on the side, but I like them. They're cute, beautiful. I need to get ready because I gotta go. I gotta go to the gym. So I'm just gonna wear these black tights that I wore yesterday for my class yesterday. And I'm gonna keep the same top that I have right now. I'm just wearing like a, like a black tank top. And 
I don't know if I should wear this sweater. I could probably wear this sweater and then take it off when I get to the gym because it's hot. And the class that I'm doing is really freaking hard. But <sighs> this is, I have this top. It's like a, just like a black top. Then I have this and I'm going to wear my beautiful shoes. This is, this is it you guys. I'm done with my nails. I'm just going to get ready and I'm going to head to the gym. Thank you so much for staying with me through this video um i'm gonna put on my shoes and i'm gonna head out